Fast, it does pretty good. It's faster than a V8 for sure. You so know. internal rim on the hatches with yep. a uh, yep. foam gasket. Yep. And they do pretty good. If I, I this boat, I have a um, epic baler in it, mm -hmm. so I paddle it without a skirt in big waves. And if when I have waves crashing on the deck, you know, at the end of a paddle, I'll end up you know like an hour long i'll end up with a cup or two of water back there they leak a little you know yeah works pretty good pretty good right on so what canoe did you build i built a uh ashes tandem quick ashes still water i've i've heard of the company yeah yeah, yeah it's a young man out in canada and uh, they, they were pretty intriguing designs. So I built a tandem quick, something that I could race with my daughter. And is it uh, Western Red Cedar? Uh, I use Spanish cedar, because that's okay. what I could get. Okay. Which isn't Spanish and isn't cedar. But anyway, apparently it's in the mahogany family, but it has a similar um, density and similar weight to oh, WRC. Excellent. Right now, there's some talk on some of the boat building forums. Um, uh, a lot of the people across the country are having trouble finding Western Red Cedar. Yeah. Now, I'm about to start another boat here in another month or two, and I was at Home Depot the other day, and they had a, even Home Depot, you know, yeah. generally crappy lumber. Right. They had some nice cedar boards that okay. I could have ripped, you know, but uh, I don't know. So, well, I may go home and buy a bunch of wood and stockpile it, you know, because people have been having problems. Well, I think it's Glenn Goldfarb is trying to build, uh, he's building a uh, canoe, and he's going to use number one pine. And, he's uh, using pine? He's using number one pine, he's weighing it to make sure it's light board. Yeah. We'll see, see how it goes. Yeah. I mean, if it's encapsulated and he doesn't tear the, you know, the fiberglass. And, yeah. But yeah, about the, the uh, lumber store, I, I'm, I'm lucky to have an exotic lumber store near me, uh -huh. but all their western red cedar is real knotty. You yeah. can't get the clear stuff in. Well, and that's well, perfectly clear. Well, this, I bought these. Yeah. I bought these pre-milled from Chesapeake Light Crack. Okay. But that's back when I was working and had a paycheck. Yeah. <laughs> so we're about five minutes out, I think. Yeah. Well, good luck to you today. What's that? Good luck. Yeah, same to you. Have fun. Yeah, man. Beautiful boat. Thanks. Endurance 18. Three minute warning. 
Yeah, it's vintage. Yeah, that's for real. <laughs> I have a special license plate for it, even. Thank <laughs> you. 